We brought Marley to the playground. I think the door's over here, bud. Over here. Open the gate. just got here today i was literally about to walk out the door take marley to the park get some lunch but it's here i'm not gonna go through everything because it's not like a huge haul or anything i just wanted to show you guys like the stuff that i was really really waiting on i've been obsessing with little tiny earrings i have two holes that's my second hole these would be perfect for uh valentine's day they're just some little gold hearts here and also addy could wear these too i bought addy this little conversation heart i'm not really into it's cute but i'm not really into like the bows and headbands i bought this for Addie. I thought she could wear it to school for Valentine's Day or Marley. Really cute. I saw we got these for Valentine's Day. They were just so cute. These are little refrigerator magnets. So, so cute. Super spontaneous. I got her a couple of pair of leggings. I got this peachy colored one, this lavender color gray pink and also black she is outgrowing all of her 3t leggings but 4t is still a little big so she's in between like even though she's five she's not like i tried on a pair of 5t leggings for girl they were sagging another pair of cute little rainbow leggings for like spring and summer for marley i think these are too big guys they're a size four they may be a little too big i also got her another little sweater here for school but this is so cute look at that oh these little leggings with the little red hearts so cute i also picked up marley this little forgot that paper falls out a little big it is a four um so marley's very tiny she may be wearing this for the next two years so cute right they did send the nails that were in perfect condition i am going to start creating my own wait a minute oh no it's fine i thought they were like frosted a color over them um it would create some type of texture but it's not i got like twelve thousand nails here so i'm starting to do my own little press-ons so i'm excited about that Now the one thing I got in this order, and I'm so disappointed in Shein for this because I was not expecting, like this could have gotten everywhere. Look at my nail polish. I am so, I don't even know which one opened. I'm annoyed. And that's the one thing in the order that I was just like, please don't fuck that up. Uh, my other bag of gel nails, these came in perfect condition. Nothing was open. I got a bunch of cute colors here. Um, I really wanted to do like some um, conversation heart nails for Valentine's Day, but they, totally screwed up look at that it is a mess so i actually need to take pictures of this i'm about to email customer service and see if they can just send me another bag of this because 
this is unacceptable. Um, the package took like almost a month to get. Like, she has got to do something for me, girl. Later that same evening. All right, guys, I just came back from the park and I am all sweated out. My hair is, me and Marley had a good time. I just wanted to come back with more of the haul that I got from Shein. I bought her this cute little honey sweater. I don't know why I wanted this for Valentine's Day. So cute. It's like almost like 69 degrees today. So I put her on something and I was like, oh, it's gonna be chilly outside. Girl, it's hot. I also got her just a plain pair of black leggings. These are the cotton leggings that I like. They tend to last a little bit longer than the polyester ones. And they sent me, this actually came in like a double pack. And these are the pink ones. I also got her a pair of black and white um leggings they came in a pair as well i loved these cute little dresses because they came as a pair uh but they have like different colors like you could pair the black with like a beige or pink or something like that but i just have the plain black one and this purple one that has little hearts on it huh yeah, the park already. yeah we went to the park already i'm just filming a video you want to say something? Hi, Mom. So, I'm glad you're here. This is a great job. This is a job. This is a job. Hey, Molly. This is a job. We, we have, we've been all in the park. Mm hmm With Molly's nerves. So, get on Molly's nerves. Do the park again. I will ship her off. Yeah, I'm going to ship you off. No. Molly ship her off. Because you're, you're feeling something. Why if you feel? How if you feel, Mom? Okay, I, I don't want to be slapped. Okay. All so right. Can I finish filming the video? No. So in my video, we have Mommy using my channel and said, Mommy, 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 I need to get my channel. No. Okay, but Mommy has to finish. Can you say bye? No. I also picked up, uh, I actually ordered two pairs of these, the same thing, so I actually have to ship this back. I ordered, and these came in cotton. They are black and white with little hearts on them, and just a paint, a, a paint, and just a paint, a plain pair of pink ones. It took me three times to say that. Love these. I also got a bunch of cute little earrings. I wanted to switch Marley's earrings up. You can't really see them in here, but they're little heart-shaped ones. I got these for me. They're little black hearts. Another pair of heart earrings. Addison needed more studs as well, so I got her these, which were really cute. Love these, so adorable. They're just brown hearts totally had Valentine's on my brain. So you guys remember in the vlog, I mentioned that I was waiting for my conversation hearts to earrings to come in. I have two packs of them and these are like so cheaply made that some of the backs have actually broken off, but get you a hot glue gun girl and call it a day. And they're actually much cheaper than the ones that I found from Hobby Lobby. So I have those. Plenty for next year, so. I don't even remember ordering this. It's just a cute little necklace. I love ordering uh, necklaces for like the spring. Got these, I thought those are really pretty. I'm actually gonna try to do like a nail design uh, similar to that. My birthstone, I got some emerald studs and another pair of heart earrings. I got another pair of, can't see these at all, but they're like a green stone pair of earrings. Addison's always like, mom, can you buy me some cool phone cases? So she specifically asked for this one. Well, this will be dirty in after two days of putting it on her phone. It's just little fur with bows on it, little pink bows on it. And she also asked for like, for like a, pink cheetah print so I got those for her but I bought this for me 
for Valentine's. I'm pretty sure I did. I'm, I, I'm supposed to have like a black phone case in this order, or maybe it's in the order that I have, the order that I have coming up. I got some cuticle oil for my nails. And to be honest, this is the same stuff that they use in the nail shops. Um, I got this base coat, this top coat. So uh, when Addie actually gets home, I'm gonna see if she'll let me experiment with her nails. I don't know if that's gonna be on this vlog or the next one, but. So this liquid peel off is for when, cause I'm kind of messy when it comes to the nails. So you're supposed to use this to paint like around the cuticle. So if you, if you know you get a little messy with your uh, nails, when you paint that on, you just use this little tool here to pull it off and it'll basically clean up your work. So um, I'll let you know how this works whenever we try it. I got her another pair of little cute brown bows, some more Valentine's little hair clips, uh, nail art to try to play with. I don't even remember ordering this. I, girl, when you're on Shein, you just be putting stuff in that cart, girl, because it's so cheap. I heard this for the first day of school. It's a little headband pencil. Head. It's for the first day of school. She has to wear this. I just wanna have pictures of her in this little cute little headband. They actually had some uh, little bows that were in the shape of like pencils. So cute. I think I might order them as well. Cause I don't know. I just, this was the first thing I saw and I had to grab it, so love that. That wasn't the last thing. I also grabbed some uh, workout gear. I actually need to try this on because if it's too tight, I don't think I want it, but I don't know. It's solely for working out and I didn't have a pair of gray ones. I didn't realize it was this scrunch booty little thing here. And when you get this scrunch booty, if it's not stretchy, this does seem to be really stretchy. If you get this scrunch booty stuff, and your booty is big and the material doesn't stretch it is so uncomfortable oh my god so um we'll see i may be sending these back i don't know just yet so. guys we are starting on addy's nails i got the gel light here ready to go we're gonna do something simple i may grab some like nail art and put it on Eddie's nail. We're gonna do like a pink ombre for Valentine's Day. So let's see. my first time it's a little messy in some areas but we gave her some little hearts here can it focus gave her some little hearts here put a little cuticle oil on her what do you think Addy? i love it do you like it i love this i'm so ready to experiment with the false nails that i got and my nails, I was thinking about maybe doing mine today. I don't know. We'll see. But, uh oh, is it messing up? I don't know. Oh. It's just the oil. I like it. Let me see. Hold your nails down one more time. Hold them up like that. Not too shabby. This is my first time. Addie hated it because she couldn't get in her phone. Guys, I'm a little obsessed with how my nails turned out. 
I'm obsessed. <laughs> so this is how they turned out. I have a little cuticle oil on them. Can you see my design? So cute, right? I really want my nails to grow a little longer so I can experiment a little bit more. But guys, I'm obsessed. obsessed. I don't necessarily know how to do my own manicure, so I'll still be going to the young lady to get my manicures done and just a clear polish and coming home and just doing designs myself. I have a whole Pinterest folder with designs that I want to experiment with. And spring is coming up. You can experiment with more color. I am loving it, guys. Let me know what y'all think. All right, guys, so when it starts to get a little bit warmer, this will be my new project. So, the only bad thing about it is I had to figure out how to get that open. I gotta replace this because if I close the door all the way, you can't open it and it had like a little lock and key. But my idea for this would be, of course I have to take the um, shelving out, replace the shelving, and we're gonna do something similar to the one we did in the house, the black hutch with like the light colored shelving, or I just may keep the shelving black. This entire back wall, I'm going to do a dark or a semi-dark, no, it's gonna be dark, a dark wallpaper. I really like the handles on here. So I may just like bronze those up to match the uh, wallpaper in the back, but I'm really, really excited to start on this. Um, you see at the bottom down there, it is chipped. So I gotta figure out how I'm going to replace that. May just take all of that off, I don't know. But um, when it does start to warm up, you guys will go on the journey with me in restoring this, because I have a really cool idea for this. And honestly, I'm just kind of ready to get out of my garage, so. Yeah, so I'm at Bath and Body Works and I'm trying to get Addison's little Valentine's Day bag together and I think she will like this sweetheart cherry. It smells really, really good. She loves everything Bath and Body Works, so I want her to try this and I'm going to put it in her little Valentine's Day bag. beautiful day outside the weather is really nice and look who's taking a stroll or drive see you later Mars she's out of here I got the first coat of stripper on I focused more on the top than I did the bottom I could not get these freaking shelves out to save my life I don't know how they got them in, but they are hell to come out. But got the first coat on. You can see it kind of breaking up the finish a little bit there. So I think the instructions tell me like 30 minutes to uh, remove. Yeah, 30 minutes up to 24 hours. So. We can keep this stuff on for a day, but I'm gonna keep it on for 30 minutes and just kind of test it out just a little bit in some areas. I should have done the flat areas first, like these areas here. I think I am gonna do that because it is easier to scrape off with a scraper, so let me do that.
Finally find the little heart that I wanted for Valentine's, but this one's damaged. I wonder if they'll mark it down. Hmm, let's go. Right, guys, we're back. We're back. Uh oh, they got this already for us. That whole palette, just take it. <laughs> How much was it? Yeah. So it's cheaper. Mm. I have no idea. Sorry. But we're here to get some flooring because we're about to start in that living room. And it's probably going to take us about a good two to three weeks to complete.